like saying it wouldn't be, but definitely go through this hallway if you're wanting more experience. Okay, now on to the last boss. The last boss. Like a boss. There used to be a gigantic bat boss in this mission, but there's not any more. I'm, I'm sad about that. I, I like that big bat. Can't remember his name, but I liked him. I'm not out there yet. Yeah! Yeah, die. I totally just maced him in the foot. It's epic. Now, this guy's a pretty fun boss. He's the captain, the commander. El Capitan. I'm the captain of the Queen's Navy. This is my rifle. This is my gun. This is for fighting. This is for fun. That's funny and ironic because that's not actually a rifle. That's a shotgun. I'm pretty sure. Let me check. A gun. That's a pretty cool name, but yeah, I'm, I'm pretty confident that that's, yeah. Commander Springvale. Time to take him down. And once again, like, you'll hear me complain a lot. I wish you could have gotten this guy's sword because it's pretty epic. And it would have been awesome to have at this low level. But, oh well. Hey, this guy's one of my favorite bosses because he actually puts up a challenge. Well... Not really, but one thing about these humans, they don't give up. This guy looked cool too. And there's that guy who did nothing again. He was level 18 elite. Could have helped me, but no, he, he decided not to. Now this will be good for you, uh tank players who are warriors, paladins, shaman, I don't know if shaman can, maybe, but um, this shield right here, the com it's really good, it's got 700 armor, 2 strength, 2 4 stamina, and only requires level 16 to wield, so definitely pick that up if you can, if you get lucky enough to get the drop. Um, ooh, cool, got some mail, just recognize that, from the auction house, yay. Huh. I'm not really focused on my fighting right now, but as you can see up in that building up there, which is where I'm going to be going, there used to be a boss. Some of you older WoW players will know it, but um, uh, there used to be a boss in there, and it was a uh, bat, a, gi a gigantic bat. I like that bat. But he's not there anymore, and it saddens me. But oh well, I'll get over it. Ooh, a large blue sack. <laughs> Don't need that large blue sack that I just got there. I have these four 16 slot bags that are hot and sexy. Yeah, that's right. I said some bags are hot and sexy. I dare you to judge me. No, really. I like comments. Please judge me. Please. Dang, I'm getting so many freaking items for the auction house. Awesome. I'm a happy panda. I'm a happy panda. That's also a benefit for dungeons. It can make you uh, lower levels freaking rich. If you do nothing but dungeons and like kind of skip out on your quest if you want to do that. Just play the auction house and sell your stuff for low, low prices. Ooh, another one. Awesome. I'm happy today. These guys have always kind of made me feel awesome because they look cool. It's like one of Arthas's warriors, but he's a sorcerer. It's pretty cool. Dun, 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 dun. Screw you, Goyle! Or Gar Goyle.
Okay, those gargoyles are like mm, tea bag. The best I can do. I don't know how to squat. I don't think you can squat, but yeah, tea bag. Tea bag to gargoyles face. Now these little guys on meth. Woohoo! All right, let's check this out. Okay, nobody, no bots. So now I have to go down into here, and there's a boss, like a boss. There also be a boss. Used to be a boss here, like right where this split bone guardian guy is. He's not a boss. He's just like a random guy. But um, there used to be a Morgan boss here, and he used to like just kind of prowl around. And if you killed him, you could just. It's just basically extra experience to kill him, but. I still enjoyed it. God, they, I wish they wouldn't have taken it. it. makes me all sad. But oh well, still one of my favorite dungeons of all time. Woohoo! Woohoo! I hate whenever my screen gets like that. There used to be a chest here too. Hmm. This gay taking out chests and bosses are kind of starting to work on my nerves. So far, this is the only dungeon that they know they've that I know they've taken a boss out of or two. But that was mainly because they were just Worgen, and I don't know. I'm gonna make up a weird story and say that the battle is like taken by the nearby flight instructor to I don't know fly around people, I guess. And the other guy was Worgen, so he probably joined the alliance's cause. Faggot. Dun 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 dun. Lord Walden. This guy's about to die. This guy's really nothing. All he does is like just sit there and just, just pimp smack me, which really does nothing to my enormous, gigantic, hairy mace. And then he tries to summon, uses crappy magic and summon some little minions who do nothing. And it did nothing. Sweet. Got a pretty good item for... Let's see. Yeah, that's pretty good. That could go real well with that shield I got earlier. That is, of course, if you're a sword and shield kind of guy. If not, that's cool. Um, you could be like me. I've heard that uh, two-handed weapons are the best thing you can be as an arms warrior, which is what I am. So I'll just... Uh, I'm just putting putting that out there and I really like being a two-handed wielder awesome and powerful because all two-handed weapons are stronger than one-handed depending on the level of course and now time to head for the very final boss huh falling down there so many times don't get fooled by that just run around the circle then go up here fight these guys on meth Awesome. They all died. Easily. That I kind of like this guy up here because he's kind of inhumane. Um, like, he's a... Un well, obviously, he's an undead scientist guy. And for some reason, he always uh, reminded me of Dr. Mengele. Dr. Joseph Mengele. I don't know if any of you guys are familiar with their Holocaust research, but... Yeah, he's a boss. Experimented on Jews and stuff. So, awesome. Look him up. Um, that's just a little fact about me anyway, so that's not to get too personal or anything for stalkers, but I love the Holocaust, or I don't love it, but I love the research behind it that you can do, all the interesting things that happened, can keep you entertained for hours. And right through here is a, the final boss, after I kill these two guys who are in my way. Get out of my way! Get out of my way! 
then a lot of talking ensues up here. Um, go ahead. Nah, keep that quest. Come on. Come on. Go faster. Open the door! Open the freaking door! God dang it, I swear to God. God help you if you don't open that door. No, you're undead, God. Sylvanas. Sylvanas will go down on... No. She will eat your penis. Okay. Now I'm in here. That guy is, like, wounded. Oh, no, he's poisoned. He got poisoned. He's a freaking level five, 85 elite. What the crap? Alright. I would run around the edges, but I don't want to. So, yeah. I always fight these big guys. They're really no problem at all. Woohoo! Bam. Die, die, die! Alright, cut that guy's arm off. Now, time to face whatever his name is. Lord Godfrey. Lord Godfrey. Dang, he killed. Dang. This guy's pretty powerful for a 21 elite. Let me check his health. Only 13,000? Huh. I was actually expecting this guy to have a little bit more than that, but, oh well. It's enough for me to destroy him with. Look at that, look at that. Killed all of his minions without him even being able to summon them all the way. Like a boss. Trying to shoot me with poison guns. Douche. He actually almost killed me there. Well, not really, but close. Oh, shoot. Okay, good. That poison thing went away right before I died. Jeebus. Okay. I finished him off. Hooray. I destroyed him. Okay. Uh, so this is EJ Starcraft. Thanks, guys, for watching my second dungeon walkthrough. This was uh, Shadow Fan Keep. I'm a level 51 now, uh, undead. Uh, my name is Severus on the Realm Etrig, as I've told you before. Uh, hit me up, add me on StarCraft. Uh, Alright, I like any new friends. Um, thank you. Thank you for watching my videos. This is EJ StarCraft, signing off.